Hi everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Katie, if you're new here, I would love if you would subscribe and come hang out. I post videos every Tuesday and Friday, just about my life, my dog, being a 20 something. Um, so yes, if you're new here, would love for you to subscribe. If you're not, then welcome to my apartment. This is my apartment tour. Um, our apartment isn't massive, but we've been here about a year and a half and I think it's just so interesting seeing layouts of apartments and looking inside because I'm nosy and curious. So this is our apartment. We Again, I said like we lived here, we've lived here a year and a half. When we moved in, we thought we would only stay here a year, that it was like an in-between, like we're just moving out, we should get an apartment, we shouldn't get a house right away, we'll get an apartment our second year, but we ended up staying here another year and signing our lease again, just because it made sense, moving is very expensive. So we're like, we're just gonna stay put, this is a really good place for us. Um, some context to where we live outside of our, like, of the apartment building is that we live right next to a big city park which is great for the dogs and we also live right next to a trader joe's and right next to a fries we literally have the mecca corner we have everything we literally would never need to leave our block so that's pretty amazing if you guys want any additional details about any of the rooms or any of the decor that's in this video let me know i have a blog post up on my blog about my bedroom and our dining room so i'll link those down below and you guys can go check those out but if you want any more details i think i talk about our furniture and like where everything is from but if you have questions let me know um and yeah hope you enjoy this video Welcome to our apartment. Oh, and there's the dog. Okay, well, we'll start in the kit. Well, actually, first, I think we need to show this. Turn the light on. Got this from Urban. We um, hammered screws into the wall, <laughs> so it's very secure. So this is cute. Right when you walk into your right is the kitchen, which this is it. This is the whole kitchen. It's not super big, but it does the job. Um, I feel like people always show what's in their fridge. We don't have anything interesting because we're getting groceries delivered in like two hours. But yeah, <laughs> the friends frame, we kept the friends stock picture in. I don't know what else is shit. We have a lot of small appliances. So we have, we have a lot of small appliances. We have like a toaster, air fryer, milk frother on the counter, cutting with vodka, very important. <laughs> um, this is my kitchen aid. It hasn't gotten a lot of use recently, but it usually does. But I don't know what's interesting about our kitchen. We have like all of our spices and stuff up here. This is like Tupperware, good things like that. This is Riley's drawer. Oh yeah, all of our cute things. This is Riley's drawer, all of her crap. And then, Oh, these are in order. Cut the camera, not cute. Okay, there you go. All of Riley's different treats, Caitlin's matcha stuff, because essential. Yeah, that's the kitchen. And then this is supposed to be a coat closet, but we turned it into a pantry, which was definitely Caitlin's brainchild. But we, where did we get this? Home Depot? Costco. Costco. And we keep our many pots and pans and then crock pot, I don't know what that's called, Dutch oven and instant pot, but top shelf's kind of a crap shoot. But this is like the pantry. And then I guess we'll go over here. This is the dining area, which I did a whole blog post about how we redid this. This is from Target. This is from living spaces, like most of our furniture. Um, but yeah, this is where we eat. This is very realistic of how it normally looks. And then yeah, Riley's food, very important. My purse, always a mess. And then this is the living area. This area of the house is huge, or the apartment is huge. Like when we first got in here, we didn't know what to do with it because it's just so massive. It's such a big space, it doesn't really have much purpose to it. Riley really thinks this is about her. It's about me. Uh, I'm the star always, but 
all of our, so the tables, side tables, and couches are from Living Spaces. And the console is from Ikea. And the plant that is dying is from Home Depot. And the pot is from uh, Hobby Lobby. But yeah, this is the living room. We moved this around a lot when we first got here. We only recently got a TV. We've been here for about a year and a half now. And this is the final version of this space, I feel like. Over here we have the outfit mirror, which has a really cute, can you see yourself? No, which I can see really you. Which has a really cute like, back to it, which is like our TV and our plants. The most essential thing when living in Arizona, delivered water that's cold and hot, so you can make tea and like have normal water. And then this has had many iterations as well. This was originally the coffee cart, and it had coffee machines and mugs and everything. Now it basically just holds all of our glassware. It's not the prettiest, but we got this from Goodwill for like 10 bucks, so it just, it just is. And then this is Riley's water fountain, which I showed in a different video, but we got a little power bar. Let's turn it off, let's turn it back on. So that's exciting. And then our nest, which they installed, which was very lovely. And then come over into the office. This is where Caitlin and I spend eight hours a day, five days a week. This is my desk, the picture, going place pictures from Citizen Home Decor. Um, yeah, it's a pretty, my desk is always messy. I always have sticky notes and random crap all over it. Um, and then I have this bin, which has just a lot more random crap. Um, this is mainly crap stuff down here, which is more fun. A lot of random crap. I have to have two monitors, so I have a really good setup for when I'm working from home. So that's cute. And then we have Riley and her toy bin, which is also essential. I got, we got this from um, a like consignment store. And it's actually, I think it's probably supposed to be a picnic basket, but it's just always had her toys in it. So it's very cute. She has lots of toys. And then this is Caitlin's desk. Here's my desk. Um, we have my monitors, all my fabric, all my craft stuff, <laughs> the bookshelf of all my craft stuff and books and printer and random storage bins. Yes. So Caitlin and I have like our own, oh, I don't really think this is all about You're her. very like angelic right now. Me? Yeah. Um, yeah. So this is the way to buy the space. We had to have desks. But it took us a long time to get to this point. We used to have the couch on this wall and the pictures on this wall, and yeah, it. The, we never saw this unit laid out with furniture, and so it never really made sense. Um, but now I feel like this is like how it's supposed to be. <laughs> um, my dog is just really on it right now, on another one. Then you come to the back door, which you've seen in another vlog when we redid the patio, but we'll come outside. Oh, I don't know if this door is unlocked. Now the door is unlocked. This leads, all of our plants are dead, by the way, except for this one, this one's still thriving. She's still thriving. Um, but this door leads into my bedroom. You wanna come in? <laughs> So I did a blog post also on my bedroom. So I'll link that down below, but not much has changed since that blog post. Um, the thing that's really great about this apartment complex is that we have massive closets and we also have our own, each have our own bathroom, which is really nice. But this is a pretty good size. This is a queen bed, a clothing rack, so. It's a decent size in here. I haven't really changed this room around too much since I moved in. I feel like I used to have a desk here and Riley's crate here, but Riley doesn't like her crate, so it's under the bed now. But plenty of room for me and Riley. These are her bowls that she never uses, but they're cute, so it's fine. And then within the closet, um, I have a dresser, which fits in the closet, and then a shoe rack, my laundry bin's in here, my hat, but again, it's just like a huge closet for an apartment, which is nice. This is the bathroom, which is not much to write home about. It's 
pretty small. These are not working drawers. I have a nice little get naked sign, but if you watched my skincare video, you saw the perspective of this. I always have my hair dryer here. I don't use it because I have pixie hair now, so yeah, I got a haircut. That's pretty new. But yeah, what are you eating? And then, then there's Caitlin's room, but we, we don't need to go in there. She can do her own room tour, but that's the whole apartment. Did I miss anything? We have a garage in the storage space downstairs, which is also a luxury, I feel like, in apartments, but that's the whole thing. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you aren't already, I would love if you would subscribe and stick around for a little bit, and I'll see you in the next one. You're making it, making it brighter. Right through the grave